Hey, everybody. Happy Wednesday night, you guys. It is Wednesday. Oh, uh, well, wins Wisdom Wednesday, we could call it. <laughs> hey, we are here to talk about skin cycling tonight. Welcome to the party. Woohoo. Let me grab my pink pom pom. All right, we are live inside our Pink Power and Possibilities. We are live on YouTube. And welcome, welcome, welcome to our fun night talking about skin cycling. Woohoo! <laughs> Super excited to be with you guys tonight. Make sure you put your name in the comments and um, so that we know that you're here. We're going to be adding to our roll-up bag tonight. Hey, everybody. Um, all right. Hi, Jenny. Hey there, you guys. Okay, I see Jenny's name, and then I see a Facebook user. I see another Facebook user. <laughs> so let me pop up that lovely banner that says to allow StreamYard to see your live comments. So let me click on here, and I'll be able to check on here, here, and there. Hi, Liz. It's Liz. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Hi, Michelle. Glad you are here. Hey, Michelle. And Sandra Maxi. Hey, girl. Welcome, welcome to Skin Cycling. Guys, you're going to be so excited you showed up tonight. Like, this is really, really cool stuff. <laughs> so if you're a beauty consultant, um, grab your pen and paper. Even if you're a VIP customer, you might want to grab a piece of paper and something to write with so you can jot some of this great information down, okay? Um, but I'm very excited. And as you hop on here tonight... Um, Okay, Sandra's a beauty consultant. Um, Liz is a guest. <laughs> Michelle is a beauty consultant. Awesome. Thank you, Jenny, for asking. <laughs> and um, hi, Laura Cazola. I see that you're on. Okay, so yeah, I think you got me confused here, but let me let me kind of <laughs> new faces are all guests. <laughs> okay, so all of our guests tonight. If you are a guest, please put in the comments. Uh, your name and that you are a guest of so-and-so. And if you can tag your beauty consultant, that would be great, okay? When you stay to the end of the program, we'll do another roll call at the end. And Jenny Larson, our fabulous um, uh, behind the scenes gal, <laughs> is gonna be um, uh, keeping track of your comments, okay? So, so far, um, and then I see Yvonne. Yvonne's here, but Yvonne's a beauty consultant. <laughs> Um, let's see here. Morgan. Hi, Morgan. Glad you are here. Uh, so Morgan is the guest. So when we do roll call at the end, we'll just make sure you're still here. Then we're going to add to our roll up back. So last week we added eight products. Uh, we've got some mint bliss. We've got a lash curler. We've got some, uh, mini pink mask. We've got a mini, um, moisture renewing gel mask. We've got some lip gloss, some lipstick and an eye cream in here, but eight products so far. And then I just have a stash uh, down here that are the identical products in here because we're going to be giving one away to a VIP customer, and then we'll be giving the exact products inside a roll-up bag to one of you guys, okay? Let me share, first of all, I have not put up the Google form, so technically nobody's entered into the drawing yet, okay? Um, I will have that up by Friday, you guys, so that you guys can start filling in your guests and their entries, Okay. So, um, and I need to post that back in the group as well, but super excited to give away this roll of bag y'all. And it's going to be packed because we still have lots of events through the rest of January. Like we are just getting warmed up. This is just event number two of like eight. <laughs> All right. So super excited. And I have a pile here of about 20 products. So when we have 20 guests on here by the end, uh, we'll be adding up to 20 products tonight. <laughs> okay. So that is here. But we're going to do that at the end. So please make sure you post in here um, that you're here. Hi, Morgan. Who is your beauty consultant? I think you're a guest of, are you a guest of Jenny? I think you're a guest of Jenny. So please comment. And if Jenny asks any questions inside the group, please answer her <laughs> so that um, she you can, you can make sure that you get on that list. Okay. So she's going to be doing our commenting um, giveaways and our drawings. Okay. All right, so throughout the night, though, if there's anything you see and you want to purchase, please type the word sold 
into the comments, okay? So that way your beauty consultant can see that and she can follow up with you and answer questions and get that product to you. Um, we've got an awesome booking opportunity because after you see tonight's skin cycling, you may want to have your own party and get some products for free, okay? So if that's the case, you'll want to type in the word book. <laughs> and that way, again, your beauty consultant knows to follow up with you. And then lastly, if you're like, God, I just want to, I just want to join y'all. Y'all are just a blast. You can always put sign me up in the comments and you can join us. So don't forget 30 bucks can start. You can start a Mary Kay business with an e virtual start for only $30. Okay. All right. So you're going to be commenting, ask me questions, you guys, and I hope I can answer them <laughs> just because this is a new topic. But what's really cool, you guys, is this whole skin um, cycling went viral actually on TikTok. Has anybody watched it or did anybody see it on TikTok? I don't actually get on TikTok, so I, I didn't actually see it. Um, but if you did, you might have an inkling uh, idea of what, of what we're talking about. But it's also been on the Today Show. It's been on some different news broadcasts. And so I'm going to give you guys a clip of that tonight as well. All right. So that's the scoop. We're going to fill our bag at the end. So let's jump in here and let's start talking about some skin cycling all right. Um, okay. I love it. Y'all are putting in the comments. Liz is your guest. Sweet. Morgan, guest of Jenny. Perfect. Hi, April. Glad you're here. <laughs> um, okay. So let's move on along into our skin cycling. So this whole theme that went viral, um, doctor, you guys can Google her, Whitney Bow. Dr. Whitney Bow, B-O-W-E, is the one that kind of um, in, in, invented or came up with this this title or this saying of skin cycling, she didn't patent it though. <laughs> so people have just kind of taken it and ran with it. Okay. Um, but there's an article and I'll post the article afterwards. If you would like to do a little bit more digging and reading, but it's a Vogue article that talks about the benefits and the purpose of skin cycling. Okay. It's the TikTok trend that dermatologists actually approve of, <laughs> okay? But I'm going to kick us off tonight with, we're going to watch a quick uh, clip from the Today Show about skin cycling. Okay, so here we go. Let me share my screen, and we are going to start off with this great, informative news broadcast. Skincare trend. I'm actually interested in this one. It's called, it's not actually. It's actually, I'm that's what you But I'm intrigued. I'm like, we're doing something. You're interested. Yeah. <laughs> it's called skin cycling. We have board certified dermatologist, Dr. Marnie Nesbaum. She's here to explain what that means and then to show us what products to use and when. Good morning to you. Good morning. So, first, why don't we just start with, because I've never heard of this, skin cycling. Yes. What is it? Okay. So, as a dermatologist, okay. my patients have become ingredient obsessed. Okay. Every time there's a new ingredient on the market, they add a product to their routine. Okay. And what happens is it's product overload. I'm so guilty of that. <laughs> all right, so I think we all are. I mean, I'm a, yeah. Each product can't possibly be doing their job. And then you don't know what's working. Exactly. You're doing so much. Because steps three and four are definitely not getting into the skin yep. like steps one and two. Mm. So, and they're causing interactions among active ingredients. Okay. So you've got all these products in your cabinet. You've got all these things. And right. You want results. Let's talk about then. So. Enter skin cycling. Okay. Skin cycling is actually a rotational skincare plan, okay. which aims to make the products you use work better, streamline your routine, and actually avoid active ingredient interaction. I'm in. <laughs> More in. All right, here so, we go. Yes. So skin cycling is actually t uh, coined by Dr. Whitney Bow, but now it's trending. So it's become great because we've been doing this for years and it just gives everyone a launch pad, how to learn how to use a skin regimen, okay. simple, effective, and avoiding interactions. Okay, so, so what it is night one? Night one, we exfoliate. Night two, you use an active ingredient, typically a retinol if you're not pregnant. Because sometimes or people do both at the same time. Wrong, exactly. Right. That causes inflammation. Okay. And then nights three and four, we rest and recover. So don't do anything. Don't do it. Well, we do a little thing, but it's easy. <laughs> okay. I'll tell you later. All yes. right. Okay. I'm done. Done. Your turn. Okay. Okay. So let's talk about night one yes. and exfoliating. Are we looking okay. at like exfoliating pads, a wash, a scrub? Excellent question. So exfoliating is actually just removing the dead skin cell layer. Mm -hmm. I actually prefer chemical exfoliators because they gently enzymatically take off the dead skin cell layer. Okay. So I like alpha hydroxy acids, like glycolic acid, salicylic acid, lactic acid. Avoid any of those physical exfoliators with those beads. Okay. They may feel good, but they cause micro tears in the skin, causing oh. inflammation, redness, 
no good. Okay. So we definitely would rather you use a chemical. And AHAs and BHAs are what? That's alpha hydroxy acids are glycolic acid, oh, okay. um, lactic acid, and then beta hydroxy acids are salicylic acid. Okay. So, so you swear by retinol, and I, I'm glad I I'm do. not pregnant or breastfeeding anymore because now <laughs> exactly, I also swear by exactly. retinol. So okay. break it down for so us. So retinol is my night to um, active ingredient. It's my workhorse. It's the best anti-aging, anti-acne ingredient that we have. Mm -hmm. It um, decreases fine lines and wrinkles, increases skin cell turnover, um, keeps encouraging collagen and elastin growth so that we keep us tight, no lines, plump, mm -hmm. and is anti-acne because it decreases sebum production. Okay. So it's the best active ingredient. That, yeah, we've got to ease into it, which is why skin cycling is so great to incorporate the retinol into it. Mm -hmm. We start with a low potency and you can increase potency every fourth night if your okay. skin adjusts to it. And moisturize after. Moisturize before retinol. That's my before. little tip and trick. Before. So, <laughs> so actually, it's a little trick. Usually people say afterwards, but if you use it before, it's actually less irritating oh, and just okay. as effective. So that's okay. my tip and trick for okay. today. Yeah, I love it. Okay. All right. Okay. The last two days, because I'm getting yes. sold on skin cycle. Okay. But the last two days, I can't not do anything, so right? So it's not rest completely. Okay. What it means is that we're nourishing and repairing the skin barrier. Mm -hmm. So after you use your active ingredient, you're going to moisturize and look for things like hyaluronic acid, which hydrates ceramides, glycerin, and brightening agents like niacinamide. Okay. You can even use things that are heavier oil-based if you're dry, if you have um, more mature skin that needs more moisture, and you can even add in things like polyphenols, green tea extracts to calm and the inflammation. Okay. So it's really great. All right. And then finally, this is not one size fits all, That's right? That's right. What is, right? Right. right. So not one size fits all. It's definitely a great launch pad and a great foundation, but you need to tweak it to your own personal skincare needs and what, what you're looking for. For example, if after your active ingredient night, night two, you see that you're red and irritated, you might choose to add a third day of rest instead of two. So you may have a five day cycle. Okay. Skincare is definitely not a quick, like it's yes. a longitudinal game. There's no quick fix. Right. So every active ingredient really takes one to three months to see maximum benefit. Oh, I didn't know it was that long. Okay. Exactly. So patience oh, is key. Yeah. And these ingredients will work and skin cycling is a great way to. One more question it. though. Yep. Off like topic here. Yes, yes. Can, can you hide? Do you have to hide or can you go out and do skin cycling in your, your regular day? Skin cycle every week, all day and long. And you can see the public, all you can meet your friends. Public. Okay. It's actually a great way to do that. Doctor, thank yes. you so much. Yeah, nice. thank you for having me. That's good. Woo. Okay, you guys, there is, okay, I'm gonna stop sharing. Whoa, there it is, skin cycling. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to start off and ask you guys, who has ever had inflamed skin or you've heard the latest and greatest new product by Mary Kay and you swooped it up, <laughs> which we want you to. We want you to use all those amazing products. And then all of a sudden you look on your counter and you have all of these random extras. So it's like you've got your regular skincare routine and then you've got like 14 supplements. <laughs> All right. So that's where this trend has definitely benefited. Uh, and is and, and it, when she was describing all of those products, I'm like, oh my gosh, like we have all of those products. And um, and we've all been guilty, even as Mary Kay, a beauty consultants co, we are our best customer. And of course, when a new product launches, we grab it up, we're using it. And I have been guilty of putting on my vitamin C, putting on my boosters all in the morning time before I put on my makeup and just layering those products on. And um, we know they're great products. We know they're good products. But like she said, by the time you get to the third, fourth layer, is that product really doing its job? And then, of course, um, when you have a booster that has an active ingredient in it, um, and then you layer on another active ingredient, <laughs> then you could have just like this explosion on your skin. OK, and so, Jenny, I love that. Yeah, you she shared she was uh, trying quite a bit all at one time and was having that rough irritation. And a lot of dermatologists right now are having like influx of people coming in with a rashy red skin, breaking out white bumps, um, but they're over processing their skin. And even us as beauty consultants might potentially be over processing our skin, just like we can over process our hair. <laughs> All right. 
So ingredients are very powerful nowadays, you guys. And so we don't want to be messing too much with that. We want to use them well. I love the way the dermatologist in that in that video, she talked about patience is key. And these, these products are powerful, but you want to let them, give them time, give them that space to do their job. Okay. So skin cycling, y'all ready? If you're like you said, um, oh, oh, let me answer a quick question. What is skin cycling? Of course, now we've talked about it, but I had a great little extra picture here of what is skin cycling. Okay, here we go. Bam, there it is. It is, oh, oh, oh no, that one's not it yet. Oh, I just I can't, yeah, hang on, hang on. That's not the one I wanted, or that one. <laughs> Okay, where did it go? There we go. Skin cycling. What is skin cycling? It is a deliberate and strategic approach to skincare that involves cycling through your evening skincare routine to drive results while minimizing irritation. Okay, so does that not sound amazing? We want to drive the results that minimize irritation. Okay, so please note that skin cycling is only for nighttime. It's at night, you guys. <laughs> um, your morning routine is pretty much going to stay set and stay put. Okay. All right. So let's jump in here with, um, all right, let me, okay. Oh, yeah, that closed it up correctly. <laughs> all right. Let me jump in here and to think I knew all about face care. <laughs> I love that. I know there's always new stuff coming out and that's what I love about just being on the cutting edge here. Okay, so um, uh, let's talk about your morning routine. Well, first of all, skincare. You want to be on a great skincare routine, okay? And of course, in Mary Kay, we talk a lot about our TimeWise 3D um, is a great skincare line for anti-aging. It's a great place to start. Um, it's our middle of the road for early to moderate signs of aging, okay? So here is your skincare routine. Uh, like we're talking like a cleanser a day, a night moisturizer, and an eye cream. That is your basic skin care routine, okay? So y'all, if you're not on that, it doesn't matter what you add to cycle in at night. <laughs> you're kind of like defeating the purpose if you don't have your regular skin care routine, okay? So this is our, our one that you can always try with us. Any Thursday night, we have Simply Skin Care. You can join us. You can get a sample pack and try the skin care before you ever purchase it. Um, our repair line. I don't know if you guys can see mine way back here. This is in our pearly pink. Um, this is another skincare line. So this regimen is fine too. It comes with a cleanser, lifting serum, day cream, night cream, and eye cream. Basics. It all starts with basics, you guys. <laughs> I know we want to jump ahead to the good stuff, the fun stuff. But again, if you're not doing the basics, the other stuff is just like putting a little Band-Aid over it. Okay? All right. So your morning routine. And I want to make sure, let me... Um, Oh, da, 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 da. Um, I thought I had all this pulled up. Let me make sure that I, yeah, there's one in here that shows the morning routine and shows, no, okay, that's not it. Okay, so you're going to wash your face in the morning time. <laughs> um, nope, that's not it. Nope, that's not it either. Okay, all right, we'll find it here in a second. I'll find it. Um, okay, so day one, every morning morning routine is going to stay the same, okay? So you're going to wash your face in the morning time. You're going to do your day cream, um, your eye cream. And in the daytime is when you can add in your vitamin C. I know some of you guys use our vitamin C. Um, oh, God, I had a picture, you guys, with this. It's bothering me that I don't have that picture up here. All right, well, let me um, let me share share this one, which will show this product. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. Window. Here we go. All right. So like your, your morning routine, here's your skincare. All right. Make sure that that's showing. Are we showing the, it is sharing my window. Okay. All right. There we go. All right. So here's our repair line over here on the left. Here's our TimeWise 3D skincare line. So a couple of the products that you can continue to use in the morning time, that's not going to be a part of your skin cycling would be this uh, uh, replenishing serum C plus E. And I don't have that one in here to show you. You could be using that one in the daytime. And then you can also be using your C plus resveratrol. Okay. The rest of the products that you see on this page, these are all the products you need for your skin cycling. The rest of these, you guys are the ones you're going to cycle through at nighttime. Okay, so skincare, they're over here on the left, repair TimeWise 3D. I wish these were all on one side. <laughs> um, your uh, C plus resveratrol, 
and then your replenishing serum C plus E. You can use all of that in the morning and just maintain that, that, um, that system. Okay. All right. So now that I probably have royally confused y'all. <laughs> um, okay. So after that, your nighttime is where you're going to actually, oh, what happened? StreamYard. We're done. We're done sharing. We are done sharing. Okay. So nighttime is where you're going to cycle in. So nighttime number one is exfoliating. So if you want to start on your skin cycling, you can start tonight. Okay. And um, you can choose uh, between uh, microdermabrasion. That was one of the exfoliations that she talked about. And we have an amazing microdermabrasion. This is a physical exfoliation. Okay. And like she said, the, the exfoliation is going to take off those skin cells. Um, but this is a physical one where you would actually microderm with the, with the little crystals, uh, aluminum oxide crystals and put your pore minimizer on. And you would do this on night one. This is one form of exfoliation. A second form of exfoliation is our uh, replenishing re or revealing facial peel, <laughs> uh, revealing facial peel. This is our glycolic peel, um, which is a chemical peel, and it's going to go layers deep to um, to get rid of all those uh, to turn over your cells and, and exfoliate on a chemical level going layers deep. OK, so you've got a chemical exfoliation a physical exfoliation. And then we also have you guys, our skin vigorate brush with it, which is another form of physical, um, exfoliation. Okay. So if you're starting on skin cycling, you may, if you have all three of these products here, <laughs> you can rotate through, of, through these in three cycles. So as you cycle through the first night of exfoliation, you pick one, Pick one. So like tonight when we hang up here, <laughs> I'm going back to the bathroom to wash my face. And I haven't decided tonight. It'll probably be between these two. <laughs> but I'm going to pick one of these to exfoliate on night one. Okay. Then tomorrow morning, I'm going to hop up. I'm going to wash my face. I'm going to put my day cream on. Actually, I use my C plus resveratrol every single day. <laughs> I will use that. Um, I'll do my day cream and my eye cream as normal. Morning routine stays the same. OK, now night number two. Um, yes, she did talk about salicylic acid. And, you know, I don't ever usually like lump that in with exfoliations. But thank you for putting that, um, Lauren. And that is in the clear proof line. We don't always talk about that one. Um, OK, night number two is the retinol night, y'all. And this is what I absolutely love. Um, I don't know if you heard her in the video talk about like getting your skin used to retinol. And um, she even referenced um no, oh, was it her? I watched another video today. I watched several videos today <laughs> of dermatologists actually saying, or even, um, oh, uh, someone had gone to get a facial and the person was telling them to use their retinol every single day. And um, <laughs> as beauty consultants, we know that retinol use every single day is actually not the best. Like we want to work up to several, you know, we were wanting to work up to several nights using our retinol, but it, first of all, it takes a process to get your skin used to retinol. Um, but to maximize it, y'all, we're talking one night, actually, you would actually use it two, two nights a week going through the cycle twice. Okay. So, um, like, because the fifth night is a rest night, you'll re you cycle through, you can get through two cycles in about an eight, eight day period. So about two, one week, two cycles. So anyway, our retinol, you guys is amazing. Cause it's 0 0.5 pure retinol here. Um, and you would use this on night number two and you would put on your, um, facial milk. And y'all, we have, the, I mean, this is the best because <laughs> when you first get your retinol set, remember the chart that comes with it. So you would go through that chart on night number two of cycle of your skin cycling to build your tolerance to your retinol. So on your retinol night, if you're just starting, you could put a little squirt of your retinol in your hand, put a little facial milk with it, mix it together, and then apply that all over your skin. And then if you don't have any issues, the next time you come back to your retinol cycle, you could actually apply your retinol directly to your skin and then add the facial milk as needed. Okay. Um, great question, April. Can we use the repair night cream with the retinol? Um, you can, you can. Um, and everybody's skin is different. And I love how she addressed that too. So you do need to pay attention and be careful because some of us have a little bit stronger. Um, we're, we're not quite as sensitive or we might not take as long to build up. Um, 
like, like our skin size doesn't take as, as long of time, but you may uh, see that you might use less April at first with that night cream. Like you might not need as much when you actually use your retinol that night. Um, okay. So that is retinol is night number two. Okay. I was going to go see. There was really another. Okay. That's not it. That's not it. Okay. I found it. I found it. <laughs> this is what I was looking for. Okay. All right. Well, let me see if I can share it with y'all. I was like, I know I'm missing one of my visual effects here. One of my visual pictures, visual aids is what, okay. That's really dating me, isn't it? Um, <laughs> okay. So here, this might even help. So you guys don't have to look at me. You know what? I hope I don't hang up on y'all, but I'm going to try to close this one extra window. Okay. Whew, it didn't. <laughs> All right. So let me share this other one. This might help you guys. So you have something to look at as I am talking away here. Okay. There we go. So day, there's your morning routine, which is cleanse C plus resveratrol, replenishing serum C plus E. And then of course you can go on to use your lifting serum followed by your day cream and your eye cream. All right, so there it is written out. <laughs> then we have our day one. We talked about exfoliating and there's your options. And then once you're done exfoliating, you follow it with your lifting serum, night moisturizer and eye cream. All right, and then we just talked about day two. So you'd wash your face, use your clinical solutions with facial milk. If you're just beginning the retinization process, follow it with your night moisturizer and your eye cream. Whoa, there, does that help you guys? <laughs> okay, so I'm not just blah, 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 blah. All right, so that's night number two, retinol. Love, love our retinol set, you guys. It is over the top, and the price value for our retinol is amazing. Okay, 120 for the set, and then as you run out of the products, you can replace them individually. All right, so if you need a retinol set, you could always type sold in the, in the comments. <laughs> All right, so we're on night number two. That was retinol. So tomorrow night, Thursday night, uh, when we have our Simply Skincare Oh, wow. We may have to adjust a little bit, whoever's on camera for that, because <laughs> tomorrow night will be my retinol night. So if you join us for that, um, I'll be doing retinol tomorrow night. Okay. Night number three, evening number three, which will be Friday night for me because I'm starting tonight. We will wash our face, hydrate with the biocellulose mask or moisture renewing gel mask. Okay. Follow that with your clinical solutions. Um, all right, so, oh, there, I thought I was all prepared. So the biocellulose mask is this right down here on the bottom. Um, I love, actually, you guys, our biocellulose mask is one of the few hydrating masks that is actually for anti-aging, okay? So it takes a moisture mask, like all those other little masks you might pick up at the store, at the checkout counter, um, even our moisture, um, our moisture, these little guys. Um, which are great, which you could use one of these as well. But the biocellulose mask has anti-aging. It has our repair patent in it from our repair line, okay? So you can use that. You could use a biocellulose mask or you can use our moisture renewing gel mask, voila, which uh, when you get your pink pampering packs, you guys, there's always a sample of this in there. And then you can follow that with your HA plus ceramide booster, and then follow along with your regular night moisturizer eye cream, okay? So in that nice, you guys, like every third night, you're just having this hydration night. <laughs> um, and, you know, I got to thinking about that. Like I try to put hydration on every night, but sometimes your skin needs, it just needs that to cycle through and have a little bit of a break, you guys. And so, so day three, wherever that lands, it's like, oh, tonight is my hydration night. <laughs> and you get to do your mask or your gel mask and then use your HA plus ceramide, which is a, um, it has an active ingredients in it, you guys. So you're going to get the best benefit of that booster on that night, followed by your night moisturizer and your eye cream. Then day four is your restore, which is also otherwise known as the calm night, <laughs> okay? Which look at that, you guys. You wash your face, put on your nighttime moisturizer, your eye cream, and you're done, okay? So it's kind of like a night off from the, the, the extras. And then you for day night or day five, you'll start back over to day one, and there you go. You go back to exfoliation. Okay, so there is your skin cycle through, you guys, four evenings, exfoliate, retinol, hydrate, restore. 
Like, does that just not sound like pampering? <laughs> and, um, and again, you guys, you're not piling on all the products at one time doing like 10 different supplements every evening going, I don't have time for this, but you're, you're, you're spreading them out in a cycle, you guys. Um, so you're getting the maximum benefits of the products. Okay. Um, they were also talking about two full cycles through, get ready to see amazing, amazing results. Okay. Whoa. So pretty simple, pretty simple. So what I would suggest if you are a guest tonight and you are already a Mary Kay customer, grab the products that you already have. Um, like take, and I'll post this, you guys, in our groups afterwards. Um, I'll post it in there so you guys can check it out. But um, go and see what Mary Kay products you already have. Like pull them out, um, make your pile, <laughs> and then decide if you've, if you've got the exfoliator, if you've got your retinol, if you have your hydration night, and then, of course, we have our calm night. But, but you got to have your skincare to start with, you guys, for your calm night. And to be using, you know, of course, every morning as well as to be washing your face. And then decide where you want to start, you guys. Okay, so there are, are the checklist of all the products. And I think I did. I Okay, I totally, let me restore that. Ta -da, ta -da. All right, so then there's a checklist of the products. So take inventory. Talk with your beauty consultant about which products you're missing. <laughs> all right. So just like what's on here, these are all the products that you need. Here's your biocellulose mask after your skincare. So you don't need both skincare routines. You just need to pick one. Your repair, your 3D. Um, here's our biocellulose mask. It actually comes with a pack of four. So that would be for four cycles through. That's if you didn't mix it with your gel mask. So like on hydration night, biocellulose, gel mask. You could pick one of those two products to start with. All right. Then exfoliation, you can choose. Do I want to do microderm? Do I want to do the ra revealing radiance facial peel? But talk through with your beauty consultant and she can answer questions, you guys, and figure out which exfoliating product you want to start with. Okay. So um, you just need one exfoliator. You just need one hydrator and one retinol, and then you're ready to go <laughs> to do and start your skin cycling. Now, this is one of our gifts, you guys. If you do choose to purchase, um, if you do choose to purchase these products, if you spend $3.99, or I actually added all of this up, you guys, it is well over $500 worth of products on this picture. But if you spend $3.99 with your beauty consultant, you will get the gorgeous travel roll-up bag for free, and you can keep all of that inside there. Okay. Great question. Great question. So Jenny's asking, where would you add in the charcoal mask? Okay. And that was actually a question that was brought up in one of the, the, the sessions that I was watching. And the charcoal mask is simply a deep cleaning. Um, you're cleaning out your pores. So it does not fall under exfoliation. It does not fall under retinol and it does not fall under hydration. So they said, use your charcoal mask in the morning like deep clean in the morning time. <laughs> um, so that's where you could use your um, pink clay mask, the charcoal mask. Those could be used in the morning time. Okay. So the deep, the charcoal mask is considered deep cleaning. Yep. 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 So have you ever thought the thought to do a mask in the morning? <laughs> All right, you guys. So how about, um, so I know probably many of us have an exfoliation Many of us probably have a hydrator, but what about the retinol set? I know um, as a beauty consultant, I have a couple, quite well, quite a few customers on retinol. Would love to have more customers. I am personally on it. But if you guys were to book your own skin cycling party with your beauty consultant, okay, um, you can have your choice. Maybe I told you guys wrong. I think I might've just told it wrong. <laughs> uh, but when you gather your besties for an exclusive event to learn about uh, skin cycling, where your beauty consultant would talk about it, you can receive your microdermabrasion or revealing facial peel for free when you host a party with five or more people. Now for that to be an official party, there has to be at least five people there and over a hundred dollars retail and sales. And as long as those two things happen, you can pick out a free microderm or a free facial peel. However, if your party goes over $500 in sales, you can actually earn the full clinical solutions, retinol set, $120 value for free. Wow. 
tomorrow. <laughs> okay. So shake up your beauty routine, you guys. Um, if you're wanting to buy one or two items here, get with your consultant and get those purchased so you can start skin cycling and then book your own skin cycling party, you guys, so that you can earn some of these products for free. Whoa. All right. So if you're up for booking, actually, since we're talking about booking, go ahead and type book in the comments. Okay. And I'll add you to a booking giveaway that we will be doing tonight, a booking giveaway. And I, and my bags are like, man, you know, you think you have it all together and then you sit down and like, oh, just grab something different tonight. Okay. So questions, what questions do you have? If there's anything you're sold on that, you know, I need this product type sold, and you might even just add the product next to it. If you want a book, just put book and you can talk with your beauty consultant. You guys can pick out a date that works and you can even discuss if you want to do a skin cycling party in person, or if you wanted to do it virtually. Okay. So questions, you guys questions. Okay. Like the same results that an their skin, not sure how to word it. Okay, like the same results that an individual person has for their skin. Okay, I'm not sure what you're talking about. Oh, do you have a mask to get the same results? Do you have a mask to get the same results that an individual person has for their skin? Oh, I'm not sure what you're asking, Morgan. Uh, I'm sure it's a great question. Do you have a mask to get the same? Like, what do you mean? Like the same results, like overall for skin cycling results? Um a single mask would not give you, okay, please, please correct me if I'm wrong, if I'm misinterpreting what you're asking. <laughs> um, but the whole point of the skin cycling is that you're exfoliating, you're doing different things. And so there's not a mask that would do exfoliation, retinol, and hydration. Does that make sense? <laughs> Great question. For a newbie with exfoliation, I honestly believe that if you're a newbie for exfoliation, I would start with microderm abrasion. Okay. I would totally start with microderm. Um, the glycolic acid is great. I love it. But if you're the slightest bit sensitive, it might be a little too much. Um, the microderm, you have control over how, how much you scrub. So you can go lightly your first time <laughs> you can be gentle. And then it's got the great pore minimizer that uh, will help calm the skin as well after you've done a great job exfoliating. Okay. Awesome. Love that question. Love that question. Um, all right. Who wants the retinol? Is that Liz? I bet that's Liz. Love it, Liz. Girl, I just sent you a package today. <laughs> um, I can't believe you don't have retinol, Liz. Like that is, yeah, that's, that's awesome. But that's a great uh, beginning um, uh, retinol. I mean, that's a great yeah, I mean, that is our only retinol, but it's a great supplement to add into your skincare routine. All right. Is a mask necessary to get the same results? Can you get a fresh, clean feeling skin without a mask? Okay. No, you don't have to use a mask in the morning. Like, um, no, masks are kind of like more for fun. And if you notice, the only time the mask, like an actual facial mask was on was the hydration step. And that was for the biocellulose mask. And if you don't want to do a mask, I mean, I'm in love with our moisture renewing gel mask. And that was another option for hydrate night. So you could totally put this on and, um, yeah, and, and leave it on all night. Like put your, put this on, you don't even need a, a, a mask. So, um, yeah, <laughs> hopefully that helped Morgan. Um, uh, da, 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 fresh, clean skin without a feeling. Of, yeah. You don't have to have a mask. I sleep in the gel mask too, <laughs> but, um, okay. That might've just confused you by me saying that. Um, yeah, but, but again, the charcoal mask and the pink clay mask, um, and any kind of like other fun mask, the height, the hydration mask, those are more for fun. And they're, they're kind of here, there daytime. Sure. You can do them at nighttime, but they're not going to be a part of your skin cycling. So you could do two, two cycles through, and then you could take a break from skin cycling. You don't have to do it forever and ever. I mean, do two cycles, see what you think, take a break. Who knows? You might go on a vacation, take a break, and then you can come back and restart on your skin cycling. Okay. But it's just a way to get the best benefits of your product um, without getting all the skin irritancy or um, issues with your skin. All right. Yeah. If your skin is, skin is really sensitive, allergic to all the high dollar drugstore. Oh, um, well, I thought and it didn't break me out. Yes. Okay. So Morgan, I'm just going to wrap up with this little comment. <laughs> 
Uh, let me just wrap up with what you buy at the drugstore versus Mary Kay. Um, we were actually having a discussion today with a couple girls about how F the FDA does not regulate skincare. Did y'all know that? Like there is no regulation. If you wanted to, you could go mix something up in some pots, put it in a bottle in your garage and you could sell it. Okay. <laughs> like that's a little scary, but you could do that. There's no regulations on skincare. Okay. And so uh, there are some, some specific products that are banned in the United States, but the list is under a hundred. Okay. It's not very many. Um, Mary Kay products follow the highest standards out there. We actually follow the European standards. I don't even remember the number, you guys. Somebody, if they want to put it in the comments, uh, I don't remember the total number of ingredients that they banned in Europe. That's what we follow. We have our own scientists that work right in the Louisville um, area, which is where our big, huge new facility, um, no carbon uh, print. I mean, it's just gorgeous. But we have our own scientists and um, we do tons of, of um, oh, just, excuse me, tests. Like our products undergo extensive testing. They are state of the art. They are, oh my gosh, like I wouldn't want to put, I mean, I know I've been in Mary Kay for 26 years, but I would never put anything else on my skin. <laughs> I don't trust it. Um, I mean, I don't know. I just, I know where our products are made. I know where they're, they're designed, they're come up with. Um, and I just know that Mary Kay follows the highest, like higher, higher standards. And um, they're only going to give us what's the best. Y'all, that's just who we are. That is just who we are. So you can buy, um, and, and Mary Kay may seem higher price up front, um, like our skincare line, uh, our TimeWise 3D retails for 120. And if you were to purchase something basically about this size at, at the drugstore, yes, it would probably be cheaper. But this skincare line, you guys, these bottles in here will last you four to six months. So you'll see our products a little bit goes way longer and um, it's, ju it's just better quality, better quality. And it's going to last you longer. Uh, I'll never forget. I have a daughter. She's 19 years old now, but when she was in high school, um, she would see all the stuff that the girls would just grab at the, at the dollar store at the drugstore, <laughs> they buy a dollar lip gloss and their lips would be peeling. Um, they would buy a facial mask, slap it on one night for a dollar and come back to school the next day with like bright red skin. <laughs> and, um, and then one time I'll end with this fun story. She wanted to buy, she wanted her own mascara. She had used our mascaras and she's like, I want to go try this mascara at Target. And I was like, okay, girl, sure, I'll take you to buy that mascara, but I'm not paying for it. I'm a Mary Kay beauty consultant. And the only products I purchase are Mary Kay. And so she was like, okay. So we took her to Target. She spent 30 bucks on a mascara. You guys, ours are only 16. She spent 30 bucks on a mascara. And I think she wore it Mm, probably I could count it on one hand and she chunked it. She was like, this is awful. Can I have one of your, uh, one of your lash, uh, <laughs> lash love mascaras, please. <laughs> and she's never asked to go back and buy anything else again. So, okay. So that's totally a whole side story, but I had to share that. Okay. Thank you guys for adding in that extra little bit. Um, uh, I know you would think there'd be FDA right since you're putting it on your face, y'all. That is like your largest organ. And that is what everybody sees. <laughs> What would be the best mask to use for someone new to Mary? Okay, so why are y'all asking for mask? Because <laughs> masking was not in skin cycling. Um, tell me why you want a mask, and then I can answer the best mask, okay? And we might can talk about that afterwards. <laughs> All right, but y'all, masking, it would be like a whole other, but it's not part of skin cycling. Um, and it just depends on what you're looking for, what results you're looking for. It would be which kind of mask. Okay. Awesome. All right. Well, we're going to give do some giveaways tonight and we're going to take a roll call so we can put our items into our roll up bag. So I got one sold from Liz. Liz is our gal each week. Love you being on here, Liz. Thank you for joining us. Excited for you to get on retinol. Did anybody else make a purchase? Did I miss anybody else with a sold comment? Let me know if I did repost it, please. <laughs> Cause I could have totally missed it. And did anybody book to get their free microdermabrasion or their free uh, facial revealing peel for having a party with five people. Again, it can be virtual. You guys, it can be in person. You choose. We'll pick what works best for you and your friends. 
All right. So Jenny, will you please, um, in the comments, would it be too much for you just to type in the first names? Uh, well, actually, if you're still here, if you're a guest, we need you to re-comment in the comments so that Jenny can confirm the six faces to fill our roll-up bag with products tonight. Okay. Six. Woohoo. All right. Liz is here. Morgan, Tina, Rita, Christine, and Danielle. Can y'all give thumbs up that you're still here so we can add your product to our bag? All right. Awesome. Liz is here. Liz is a new repair customer. Girl, are you loving your repair skincare line? All right. We got six. Morgan is here. Morgan, thanks for joining us. Whereabouts are you from? I think you're Jenny's guest. Thank you. Thank you for being here. One, two, three, four. Okay. Four, five, six. Okay. All right. We got Morgan and Liz. Where's Tina, Rita, Christine, Danielle. And actually, can somebody go check our YouTube? Uh, we are streaming to YouTube as well. Let us know that you're here. Let us know that you're on still. Actually, I probably should have gone and checked YouTube. Okay, it's it, YouTube is actually not going to let me in. <laughs> Y'all, I had to have my phone <laughs> fixed. And when it came back, like everything was logged out. All right, let us know that you're still here so we can put our product. Um, that we can put our product in the roll-up bag. You're originally from Alabama, been in Louisiana. Awesome. You're about to move to Illinois. Wow. <laughs> love that. And I love that you can be on with us tonight. Sweet. All right. Well, what we're going to do, we're waiting for, we got um, Morgan and Liz. <gasps> Oh my gosh, we're going to miss out putting our products in our bag. <laughs> All right, Liz, of course, is going to be our winner for our sold night tonight. Um, if you were a guest tonight, our six guests that were originally on, just expect your beauty consultant. She's going to give you a quick call tomorrow to see what you learned, what you love the most, and of course, if she can take care of you in any way. All right. Awesome. Okay. Somebody else is here, but I've logged out of the Facebook group now. So go ahead, Jenny. And if you will go ahead and spin the will and let's do, let's do two giveaways tonight. I'm going to give away two hydration masks and you could use this on your hydration night. Okay. We're going to give away two of our masks tonight. So if you'll go ahead and spin the wheel from all of our comments, and then um, I'm going to show you guys what we're going to put in the bag with our six guests tonight. We're going to have to use a little confirming to make sure they were all here. But I will show you what our six items are. But if you'll spin the wheel for two winners. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, because I've got six products here. <laughs> all right. Hi, Allison. Glad you made it. Woo! All right. Congratulations, Liz. Was she one of the ones first drawn, Jenny, off of our Wheel of Names? All right. Glad you joined us. Okay. And Morgan. Okay. Those are our two uh, winner, wheel winners. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Wheel, wheel winners. Okay. Liz and Morgan, congratulations. Woohoo. All right. Well, it, we may have somewhere between six, seven guests. I know Allison is getting on here. Um, and you could always go back to the beginning because go back and, and watch from the beginning. Um, but let me show you the products that we're putting into the roll up bag tonight. I have a compact. This is one of our, um, da -da -da -da. uh, in this beautiful, Oh, it's one of our compacts. Da -da -da -da. Um, and so this is going to go into the roll-up bag for one of our guests. And then I've got a cheek color. So there's product number two. I've got three eyeshadows to put into our roll-up bag. So what is that? Three, four, five items. <laughs> and then I have another lipstick that actually goes with this look. It's called Mauve Moment. Okay, so we're going to put these six products in as long as we get everybody confirmed that they were still here to the end. And then Allison, if you rewatch, I think we'll probably be able to pull you into that count as well. Okay, so six more items added to our roll-up bag. That's getting exciting. It's getting full. <laughs> All right, if you guys have any questions on skin cycling, um, reach out. I'm going to actually post. Um, okay, Rita's here too. Okay, 
sweet, sweet. Was she in the original list? Okay, well, I'll figure that out afterwards. Okay, um, I'm going to post the article on skin cycling. I'll repost the today video if you want to watch it as well. And then I'll put some of the pics in there so that you can see the routine. And the last thing I'll say, you guys, is print you off a calendar or have your beauty consultant and I can print you off a calendar and then you can put um, just just like or even on your daily calendar, start tonight, exfoliate and then put tomorrow night um, retinol, hydrate, calm. And then just put those on your calendar. And you might even get so quick where you just put an R for retinol, H for hydrate, C for calm, <laughs> E for exfoliate. And you know exactly what you get to do that night to take care of you. And let that just be part of your self-care, you guys. I know the world is crazy right now. Um, there's, there's, yeah, the world is just crazy. So please take time to take care of you because when you're the best version of you and you're taking care of you, it's like putting that oxygen mask on you first. And then when you're taken care of, you have more to give to those around you. All right. So take care of you so you can go out and be even more of a blessing to others around you. All right. Thanks for joining us tonight. You guys have fun skin cycling. All right. Bye-bye.